Yo, what's up guys, AFC Edino here, continuing the road to top 100, we are currently Ace Trainer, um, let's see if we can win like three games uh, on this episode, should be doable, should be doable, um, unfortunately still, it's a bit sad, but we lost the first game, uh, yeah, but that's what happens when you're low on the ladder, I, do, I don't decide my teams to be that specifically, uh, like, strange shit, <laughs> these teams are against decent teams but yeah uh, if you guys are interested in this team you can check it out on patreon there's poker paste plus team building video on this team and yeah don't forget to like comment and subscribe and yeah we're gonna go for this one i see venusaur do i see a torkoal i don't see it i see a venusaur i see a darmanitan i see a shell but i don't see a torkoal definitely stealth rock is going to be awesome <laughs> I'm gonna start it up with my Rotom. Um, I think overall pretty decent matchup. He leads up with Venusaur. It's uh, that leaves a sour taste in my mouth. Uh, but I'm gonna go into Shower. And yeah, we'll go from there. <laughs> I'm not sure what kind of dragon we're facing here. Uh, he's not running really Sun. Maybe a sunny day or something. That can be some. That could be possible. He just sludge bombs. The 30 is a lot, bro. Anyway, um, that's a 2 hit KO, unfortunately. I'm just gonna U turn. I'm st oh my god, he's I'm faster. Damn, bro. <laughs> Why am I faster, bro? Oh, yeah, I'm not in the sun. I'll keep that in mind for next time. Quite unfortunate that he had to. I, I'm just, I need to knock this off. This shit is annoying. I need to knock this boy off. Yeah, that poison on me is annoying, bro. Hidden power, I need to knock him off. He can train. I don't, last move might be synthesis, but... Uh, knocking this boy off. It's hit him. I still don't know if this... It's probably hidden power fire for scissor. But I might be wrong. Growth. Okay. That's that's how it is, huh? That is how it is, huh? Just gonna go this guy. Oh, it gives me healing instantly. What I'd like to see. And I'm gonna go straight into Hydreigon on the Giga Drain. And then I'll be able to throw off a Flamethrower. Annoying guy. Because even if Chandelier gets a Flash Fire, it doesn't matter. But this Venusaur is super annoying. Don't poison me, please! Please! Did you actually just... Are you kidding me, bro? Really, man? How much did my U-turn do? Now I don't get rocks versus that team. Look at that. I don't get rocks versus that team. Really sad. I'm actually in a in a lot of trouble there because if I had rocks up, look at his four four of his mounts are weak to it, bro. Don't don't tell me you're freaking. Please don't tell me you're Maricot. I'm gonna cry. Man, I'm really... I am really sad over here! That Phineas are really screwed me over, with, especially with the Sludge Bomb Poisons. 
You got it three times on the first uh, on the first ones. That's just insane. Are you serious, bro? I really hope I kill here. Um, I'm in trouble. I am really in trouble. There's no way I don't do. These stupid team, stupid ass teams, man. Hidden power I should be able to kill. I don't want to Volt Switch because it's going to put me in a, in a bad position. So it really depends on how my opponent is going to play this one out, but that Phenosaur is super annoying. He was really using Growth as well, but he got the Sludge Bomb on me and he poisoned me. If he didn't poison me, it would have been all good. And this, I lost anyway. There's no way I'm gonna beat their Manitan Dragon Knight. <laughs> the Knight Slash here. Maybe I should have pain split it there. I think if I pain split it there, I would have had more HP and then I could have played around. Because that was my fire resist, which I don't have anymore. But the thing is, I should have pursued I, I I hope he stays in. I should have pursued it there. Because then I just have to hope for a miracle with my Dragonite, which is not going to happen. Yeah, I just lost anyway. Man, this is so lame. That's a piece bandit or something or life warp. I'm gonna stay in there. Yeah, that, that Venus sword just screwed me over. <laughs> like, why the fuck would you not click a fire move, bro? I lost anyway. Abundance. I should I should have just knocked off the Phoenix at turn one. Oh, this is bad. This is ah, oh, that's so tilting, bro. Because if I just knocked him. So I still agree with my Rotom lead, but he led up with Phenosaur, bro. Bro, what the fuck, man? He lead up with Phenosaur. I have a Hydreigon, I have a Weavile. I have Glyph, I have Mianchao. I even have my own Among Us. It just ended up working out there. Um, like I said, I did have options, but... Like I said, it... it, it, it both the poison... Like, the poison on my Mianchao meant I died. <laughs> to the Miracut as well. Like the extra damage. And he first time poisoned my Glide Square. That was good for me, but still. Principle. And he fir and he first time poisoned my Hydreigon. Because if I did if he didn't poison me, I would have been able to click Dragon Pulse next. And then get leftovers back. And he didn't have any counterplay to the Dragon Pulse afterwards, but then I lost my Hydreigon. Just like that. 
So annoying, man. I'm gonna pause the video and we'll be right back. Okay, we're back. Yeah, I got the other game. It should have been easy. It should have been easy, but... <laughs> uh, didn't play that really well. And yeah, with the poisons, of course, it's really annoying. This one has a Sableye. His Ice Step Resist is Magnezone. That's really interesting. What is... That's really interesting. Um, let me start it off with this guy. Eyes are out. Mega Sableye. Do I care if I get burnt? Do I care if I get burnt? I do care if I get knocked. Or do I? I don't think so. If I get knocked, it's only for Magnezone, the Assault Fest. He stayed in, so he probably knocked himself. Oh, he just foul played. That's, uh, that's good. A U turn there. He tries to wisp me. Like, the wisp is okay. Still getting my HP back. I'm gonna get Heart Dragon in, and we're just gonna click Stealth Rock here. His only real switch is going to be the Tyranitar, which I don't really touch anyway. He's getting off. Stealth Rock here. And that's gonna help me uh, later on, because um, literally, Icicle Spear and it will kind of destroy him. So for this one, I am going into Mian Shao. Um, ideally, he just attacks with something. Just not with Joyce Bandit Superpower. Okay, perfect. Because now I can just ice, uh, I can just U-turn, and if Glasscore comes in, I just click uh, Icicle Spare with Weavile. Or he has to go into Sableye. Yeah, Glasscore comes in. Uh, I didn't need to click Knockoff because I want this positioning. Because he could have just also gone back into Sableye. But now I get him Weavile, and like I said, his Ice Type Resist is Magnezon, so... Unless Magnuson is like defensive. There's literally no reason to over predict there. Obviously he has full HP Tyranitar, he has full HP Ferrothorn, but if I get enough hits, it's still gonna do a lot of damage. And against Ferrothorn I can bring in my Among Amoongus if I want to prevent him from Leech Sheet recovering. And I guess the Tyranitar, he showed Ice Beam, so I can just go back into um and Shao. If he goes Magnezone, like I said, it's his only resist. But he can only do it a few times because there's no recovery on this guy. Okay. One, two. Three leftovers? I don't know. But I will always go this. It has to be typical that I get two hits on uh, Magnezone. But it is what it is. I will still U-turn and yeah, we're, I'm basically I'm gonna create the same situation there. I will always freely U-turn even if I'm burnt. If he's choice guard, I can just go Rodom. And I will Volt Switch here. Um, like, Hydro Pump can be really scary for him right now. So if if he's the player that goes into Glass Square right here, then, uh, I, I, then I just don't know, man. And I just don't know, bro. Like, why, man? But you know what? Okay, I, know, I at least know how my, how my opponent is operating. I, the rank doesn't tell me anything. So, now I know how what kind of player he is. So I'm definitely going to utilize. I'm going to go Hydreigon here. Could have gone Amoongus to be safe, but he probably wants Hazards up. So 
I'm gonna flame here. He's probably gonna go Tar again. The Tar only has limited amount of. He got the best case though, um, with all, all the dancing around, but I'm pretty sure he doesn't have any recovery on this. So I can just go into um, Redom first. As he tries to go for pursuit, I'll be that guy. You be that guy, bro. You know, I'm, I'm getting tired of this. I'm just gonna win with Gliscor. I'm gonna win this game with Gliscor. Getting tired of this. He's been pissing me off, man. He only has limited amount of switches in on me anyway. He's just staying in against me, but look at how... Because the moment Tyranitar dies, I literally win with Hydreigon versus you. And he just revealed every attack in the book. So that's cool. I'm a defog here. I know how the Ferrothorn is a style rocker. Time we're going to show. Well, you turn again. He's going to be at full HP. Dragon. I want to get up with rocks. Wait, he's double rocks. Seriously, dude. Okay, he's really pissing me off. <laughs> Come on, man! Why are you double rocks, bro? I'm to SD here. But are you gonna reveal Ice Fang to me, too? Time to end this shit, bro. It's really time to end this shit. Bring in High Dragon here. Really tired of this bullshit. Yeah, we knocked off his leftover, so he's not gonna dance around long against this guy. Serenitar can come in, but yeah, that doesn't work, bro. Yeah, now you're in stealth rock range, so what are you gonna do? I'm just getting HP back, so it's all good. He just gave me free XP. 
uh, free HP. Yeah, so how are you gonna deal with this high dragon now? I drank up those dragon. Now you have to go into the Renatar again, which comes in on rocks. As long as Amongus is full HP, I can keep Dragonite in check. Yeah, you're not gonna win. Really run double rocks, bro. SD, Magnuson comes in. He was Choice Scarf, so we know that. So basically, not letting just just by the off, ch off chance, right? He has HP eyes. I can just go this guy. comes in he still came in on rocks okay we know he's scarf because he outspread me so i just u turn there get in this Playing the predicting game. Yeah, what, are gonna, what are we gonna do, bro? Dragonite comes in. Let's see if you're leftovers. I'm gonna saw there. No leftovers. I'm gonna saw there. Or your choice bandit, huh? You dead, bro? Oh, you did. Okay. You're not dead, bro. <laughs> I can I, I can always take Rotom later. Um, or something. Always bandit. He goes down. Okay, and I assume Magnezone comes in. Maybe he goes star. Doesn't really matter. A dragon already wins from there. I'm outside of flash cannon range. Do something, bro. Come on. Renatar is low. I just need a dragon to beat him. Plus a glide score. So. That is all we need. You just sack Rotom. Mr. Renatar did get my Rotom really low because I didn't have Hydro, but it is what it is. Get in this guy. And I'm just picking close combat there. And I die here. And then... I die to the burn, but I just need the damage from this on him. Because now I can just knock him out with Weavile. A Weevil. I have Amoongus for Ferrothorn. Literally click Spear, even if he's Scarf or faster. Renatar will die to me 
Barathorn can come in. The only thing I can do with the Knight is have Among Us uh, sitting there. Okay. You can do that. You're still gonna die to two hits. Because it was obvious you were spit death tar. As long as I have this guy, he can never heal. And he stays, that's perfect. GG GG Mungus beating the Ferrothorn and now all he has left is the Glyscore. And I was I will just go straight into Glyscore against him. I wanna give him an extra mon. He doesn't deserve to kill one of He doesn't deserve to kill an extra mon against me. Even if he kills Glyscore, I just go Weaver and click Ice Spear. It's really matter. And if I still don't kill him, I just go Hydreigon then. Obviously, the solid play would be to um, sec Mungus. If you were really trying to win this game. But I felt like my opponent didn't deserve to kill an extra Pokemon, so we're just gonna Roost. And we're saying goodbye to him. Let's roost again so I'm outside of crit range. And then I'm gonna sword stance and beat him. That guy really ran double rocks, bro. Time to mess you up. You know the funny thing as well? That guy clicked Thunderbolt on my Gliscor when I was Sword Stanced up. As he decides to worth it. That was, uh, that was really annoying, bro. <laughs> but, uh, yeah, bit of a bit of an bit of an annoying one uh, today. But uh, hope you guys still enjoyed. Like, comment, subscribe. Check the team on Patreon. Peace out.